Well, I think that's that for the flashbacks. I think we can put the pieces together from there. I mean, we pretty much know everything about his childhood now. We know, like, you know, what happened before he got on the cooking ship. What happened on the cooking ship, for the most part, like, unless he had some kind of adventure there, which I doubt. And then what happened when he was taken off the cooking ship and basically spent the rest of the time with the old man until the straw hat spin. So, or did he? Didn't he show up as a guest? Am I crazy? Didn't he, like, show up as a guest, sit down, and ask to be served or some shit? Or am I crazy? Or is that somebody else? I can't, I actually can't remember. Like, that was so long ago. That was, like, episode 30 or 5 or something. I can't remember how they actually, the first episode we ever saw Sanji in. Like, how he came out. It felt like he was walking in, he sat down, ordered some food, maybe complained about the food and brought the cook out. So I guess he had left, had he left the restaurant? Or am I crazy? Or am I conflating the other things I've watched? That's entirely possible. I don't know. I don't remember. But for the most, my point is, for the most part, now we know it's full backstory. So let's go ahead and get into this episode. This will be 8.05. We are going on one. Three, two, one. Yeah, by the way, it was the you know, same place as last time, uh, right after the credit sequence. Doesn't help you now. You'd have to back up if you screwed it up, but you know. I'm sure you noticed they didn't have the the saga cell, I guess we'll call it. I just saw a really big fat uh, Luffy. I didn't see the title, but I saw the big fat Luffy. <laughs> Dicks. You know, talk about how every island you go to you get the property damage, the island gets destroyed. This group of ships is going to be destroyed. I'm convinced of it. It's going to the bottom of the ocean. Oh, now she comes crawling in here. Look, she let him go. I'm into it. But still, she didn't come in and try to help him. <laughs> Meanwhile, she's bullying everybody, which ain't good. Well, what's he supposed to do about it? They knew what they were doing, and I'm sure Dad will be mad. Yeah. Well, my thing is, you can't you keep using the same hostage as a threat over and over and over again. Now, when we know the the marriage is what matters to you the most, he could have fought back and whipped all three of their asses, and their father would not have given the order to kill the guy because he needs a guy as a threat for tomorrow for the wedding. That's that was my point. That's what Sanji couldn't see. F you, man. Like, you gotta understand the situation you're in. Tip that's why typically blackmail and hostages and stuff, it's a one-use thing. You can't keep using it or the person's gonna just give up on it, right? But especially in this case, when you know there's something they really want. It would be different if they didn't care what they what they wanted. These guys are, these guys, the biscuit guys are annoying. <laughs> the biscuit guys are annoying. <laughs> I would have had her attack the biscuit guys with water, right? Get him soggy. Maybe slow him down. You better find something to eat. Is he going to eat the biscuits? Is he going to eat the biscuits? Oh my God. Oh my god, that could be the answer to all your problems. You eat these suckers. You just gotta watch out for the swords. The swords will be kinda they'll kinda hurt if they go down, right? 
Didn't you say that before? <laughs> yep, he's going to eat them. He's going to eat them. Boy, this is bad for you guys. Oh my god. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Shit. I guess it's like hard tack, right? Ah, shit. I thought I had the solution, man. They're like hard tack. You gotta soak them in water. Hey, Nami. Why don't you soak them in water, man? Like hard tack. That's right. Mmm. I'm on this, man. You know, when I wrote the script for this episode, <laughs> that's right. The answer was among us the whole time. Just like heart attack. You got to soak heart attack in water or coffee or something, or maybe soup, right? And then you can eat it. You can't just eat it as is, right? That's the whole point. No, now we're soft, man. You don't understand. Try again. Shit. Yeah. See, now it's soft. Yeah. See, lightning wasn't good. It just hardened, like he said, man. Eat him. He's going to eat them all. Use that energy to look at him. <laughs> yes! That's right. Chomp. <laughs> he's gonna eat them he's gonna eat his way to the big bad yeah give me that food <laughs> chomp oh yeah it's over eat them right now before they completely form because it looks like even the swords are biscuits at first and then they harden in the swords right yeah <laughs> that's right He's going to use his power to eat. <laughs> what is it? Um, what am I thinking of? There's some kind of animated creature that like eats everything really fast. <laughs> I can't remember, but like that's you know, basically we'll call him Pac-Man, right? Wait a minute. That's why he, had, he looked fat, right? That's why he looked fat. Yeah. <laughs> that's right. Chomp. Because they're delicious. Yeah, <laughs> look at him. He's got his arms full. <laughs> right. That's right. Eat it all. She really is smart, man. I'm going to have to give her some more smart points. Cunning, shall we say. <laughs> What's up? Yeah, keep making them. Yeah, that's that's hot. <laughs> Chomp. <laughs> oh, my God. He's about to kick your ass. I'm talking about purple boy here. Yeah, that part's the most delicious. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. This is a great solution, man. Tell you, man. His superpower is that he's hungry. Yeah. <laughs> Chomp. So he kept reforming the same biscuits. I guess I kind of thought maybe they were coming from the ether or something, right? He kept reforming the same biscuits, so they're now going to diminish. There won't be as many because he's eating them. Well, more food for me. Oh, it seems like there's still a lot of them. Shit. More rain? <laughs> How so? <laughs> now what are we gonna do? Um, put the biscuits. Yeah, <laughs> he's gonna put the biscuits through some kind of like um, 
candy or something or syrup or like you're, there, there's like all this delicious stuff around, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I can't believe I didn't think of this before it happened. Like, it's, you don't get points, prediction points, not that I keep track of that shit, but, like, you don't get prediction points if you think of it right before they tell you, right? Because everything's been set up. You need to think of it before they tell you, right? Meanwhile, I should have, this should have occurred to me a long time ago because he eats all the time, that's what he's known for, and they're biscuits. Damn it. Yeah. I should have seen it. I was saying use the water, though. So I get, you give me like one quarter credit. Because I was saying lightning's not going to work, but water would work. I thought I'd just make him soggy. I didn't think about eating, you know. Well, shit. That's just fantastic. <laughs> what a bitch. Great. Yeah. <laughs> you ever see airplane when she's trying to put the makeup on and they get the, they hit all the turbulence? Good shit. Yeah, that's a good way to run. You pick up the balls. I didn't even think about that. That was all this. Ha ha. Ha ha. I see. He put them in the juice, right? That softens them up and he can eat them. These are going to get really big. Get in my tummy. Ha! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Ha 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 ha! Good lord. Very troubling. Very, very troubling. <laughs> Boy, you crazy. Why, you little... <laughs> That's right, chomp. Don't get mad now. Yes. Yeah, I like your Looney Tunes sound effect. Now turn that shit into energy and kick his ass. They really are good, man. <laughs> Goddamn right. Good job, Nami. Yeah, bit of a problem here. I talked about this in the Q&A if you haven't seen it. <laughs> not gonna happen. No, oh, it did happen. Shit. Well, I guess he does. He can just make an infinite amount. Okay. I thought Nami was saying he couldn't. Oh, he is tired. Okay, that's good. Well, maybe now he can fight. He doesn't have to worry about running out of energy. <laughs> At least soggy, they can't do much. Even if he doesn't eat them. <laughs> really? More eating? I bet you just crush them. You can smash them. You don't have to eat them. <laughs> I hate this character design, by the way. I don't like Fat Luffy. Too much like Fat Albert, you know? Alrighty, I guess you take the, the entire place, right? You don't have to take a separate ship. Hey, they shouldn't have beat him up, man. 
Like, these kids do not obey their father. This is technology that will fix him. Okay. I got you. I thought it was somehow going to shield or make it look like he wasn't hurt, right? Like a glamour? <laughs> Good shit. That's pretty good, though. Oh. Fair enough. Yeah, he won't have that name that he hates so much. <laughs> you weren't going to do anything if you hadn't come back voluntarily. She could do jack shit. She let him out once. Congratulations. <laughs> Probably because she helped him, right? Like the woman, the female member of the family is the only one that was worth a damn. That's probably where that comes from. Or are we going to get backstory for that? Really? We're going to get flashback to explain why he's chivalrous? Like, is this what we need to know? Interesting. <laughs> What's your problem with the female chef, you dick? <laughs> oh, okay. That makes sense. <laughs> he don't give a shit. So this taught him chivalry. Okay, I got you. <laughs> Come on, man. Domestic violence. <laughs> so we have dinosaurs in this world, huh? Wouldn't have called that one. Normal evolution. I kind of thought maybe aliens came and pot played the planet, or we came from another dimension or some shit. I wasn't sure we actually evolved on this planet. I've talked about that before. God damn, man. You're out of your mind. He's crazy as hell. Shit. I wonder if um, this is foreshadowing for what's going to happen to Santi's father. The father pays the price, right? For what his children do. Interesting. Yeah, so... Not really an elaborate flashback. I thought maybe there'd be a female character. He'd hang out with her. Learn to respect women. Whatever. Not that he respects women now, but you know what I mean? <laughs> Get mad, bitch. He's tired as hell. <laughs> you should be. <laughs> oh, are you tired? Tell you what. He's a human Pac-Man. I think he's exhausted, man. Right, exactly. He's going to pass out. Yeah, not gonna happen. I still think you could, at this point you could like get him wet and crush him. Didn't do it. Why are you just standing here talking? Uh, I guess he's actually gonna do it. Huh? Ah, god damn it! Jesus Christ! <laughs> I guess this dude has to die, man. That's not punishment enough. Not good enough. Yeah. Well, damn it. They're not hard biscuit warriors anymore, are they? They're soft cookies. Delicious, crunchy snacks. You said it, not me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
She has a very firm point of view, doesn't she? She has a firm point of view and she never backs down from it. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. Cry. Sit there and cry. <laughs> yeah, you got to figure out something else, man. This is the first time he's ever said he can't eat anymore. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh shit. No mercy. She is merciless. He's like, come on, man. Ah, shit. She is merciless. Ruthless. Yeah. You know what this means. Man, this ain't good. It reminds me of that bunny and uh, Ralph Breaks the Internet. Was it a bunny? I don't know. It made me sad, whatever it was. I didn't like it. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, God damn it. Jesus. <laughs> Holy shit. I still feel like you could just... I know if you break them up, they come back. But that's better than this shit, right? Like you, I would think. I don't know, man. There's, there's got to be a way to just like keep smashing them because then you can be burning up energy and then maybe work up a little bit of an appetite again. I don't know. <laughs> 